Good day and welcome back to another DBZ Dokken Battle video. In this video we are going to take a look at the New Year's celebration for DBZ Dokken Battle. So this is the Happy New Year 2022 celebration that has come out with DBZ Dokken Battle, obviously in celebration for 2022. And with it we got some new special missions so these special missions are pretty straightforward we don't have the new daily missions yet as we're currently still running under the old ones but the missions are pretty simple perform an extreme z awakening which you should be able to do with the extreme z area finish a certain amount of doken events use some support memories clear a stage with a certain amount of zeni required and of course consuming stamina there's nothing here that is too out of the woodwork the one that is the most out of the woodwork is pretty much the one that needs you to extreme the awakener unit but you should pretty much be able to do that like with relative ease it's nothing that's too crazy so to say uh you should pretty much be able to do it um it's nothing that's too nuts or anything like that in terms of login bonus we got 22 stones for logging in and then in terms of the remainder of items, we had a pretty straightforward uh, situation. So we had, um, you know, nothing too crazy, one free stone a day. Uh, we also managed to get, you know, uh, some Zenny and some Zenny rewards. Uh, you know, if we look here, uh, you get the new, uh, what appears to be Jackie Chun statue, which is 22 million or so zenny which will help out most people the next dfe that we will be receiving is the strength super vegeta who will be a pure sans lead he'll be released shortly uh we're currently dealing with the world tournament so you know it's being slightly delayed we'll also be receiving the legendary vegeta event or the lve as it's commonly known pretty much a similar event to the legendary goku event so something really nice obviously just to change your pace um in a way for us to experience a similar kind of long form event but without it just constantly being goku uh, and with it comes new ticket banners as well then we have the actual happy 2022 new year celebration something that's pretty straightforward uh if i'm honest uh nothing too crazy that's obviously come out here uh so you get the new banner that's come out the brand new step up banner which we'll talk about in another video there's been two new stages added to the extreme z area uh for the int super saiyan goku uh and for the android 18 unit we then have a returning event we have a new support memory that's been added in as well uh, which is super helpful and of course we have the upcoming doken fest banners for the super strength vegeta or the super vegeta strength or you know whichever one the evolved super saiyan warrior i think he's called obviously the lve along with its banner will be dropped later on and then we also have a new virtual dokan ultimate clash later on we'll be receiving a double rates ssr banner which is something to you know take a look at it's got some pepe gals units on there which could be somewhat interesting and then we also have a new Extreme Z battle that will be opening up shortly that features a lot of Pepe Gals units along with a new Prime battle Gohan. So that's going to be something really cool. And that's that for the current announcements of content for the celebration. Looks pretty good overall. Nice and jammed packed. Virtual Dokken Ultimate Clash will be some stones. LVE will be some stones. The new Dokken event will be some stones. So overall, it looks like there's some nice new stones, along with the nice chunky 22 stone login bonus. You can at least look forward to some pretty interesting, uh, you know, stones to be received. This Extreme Z area features the Yardrak Goku, who will be receiving his EZA, becoming a pretty useful Pure Saiyan and Super Saiyan unit, along with a Android and Cell Saga unit. And then we also have the uh easy a for android 18 a android category support it seems and a pretty useful unit for that as well so overall some pretty good easy a's uh we'll definitely be taking a look at those and how they operate at 100 percent which i think will be the most interesting thing we can definitely do with them and then yeah uh pretty much that's it there's a new support memory that has been added in 
that's been added into the Vegeta event and it's a pretty nice support memory uh, it's nothing crazy but it is well I mean it is crazy uh, it is a Super Saiyan and a Super Saiyan 2 support memory something not necessarily that was needed but something that is obviously quite helpful uh, and we'll be doing a video on how to get that but it is pretty straightforward as per usual collect the film memory and then of course you can utilize it so that's something that you can also focus on as well but overall uh, the only real thing you should currently be focusing on as at this video is the world tournament trying to get in as many runs as possible so that you can obviously gather those dragon stones and beyond that, that is pretty much it. Uh, we have the Step Up banner, which we'll talk about in another video, but it is, of course, a super good banner with lots of LRs and lots of great DFE units on it. There's so much going on with this banner that we definitely do need to cover it in a separate video, but overall, uh, it is definitely something to summon on. I don't think you need me to tell you that. It is fantastic. But that's pretty much going to be it from me guys, so I hope you enjoyed the video. As always, leave a like if you did, or a comment if you have any other questions. But that'll be it from me, take care, enjoy 2022, and as always, bye!